Hi, Lakrita. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thanks. So as opposed to our predecessors, I feel like Greg's a little more sweet and sassy rather than <laughs> snarky in a way. Um, was that on purpose? Did you want to kind of separate yourself from your predecessors a little? <laughs> I think for me, I wanted to marry them. I wanted to be oh. uh, uh, a, a lovely, like, you know, oh, if, if such and such and such, such had a baby, it would be. So if <laughs> Bull and Ross had a baby, it would be Gerg. So she's got the weird, weirdness of Bull, but she has the weird <laughs> of Roz, the no nonsense of Roz. You know, she's not as tall as Bull, but, <laughs> you know, you know how jeans are sometimes. But yeah, yeah. I want to see an end of the two of them um, and, a, and a, definitely a nod to both of them. I, I watched the first the first couple of seasons. I've missed, uh, you know, there's nothing that I've seen the complete season runs of Nightport, but I know that we had two um, bailiffs that came before, Selma Diamond and... Gosh, I'm terrible for not remembering. So I wasn't as familiar with those two first, but uh, uh, Marcia Warfield joined season three. So from three yeah. on, more familiar with them. So that's, you know, had I gone black, gone back and done more research, I might've tried <laughs> to spring a little bit of the two in for previously, but I, I think I did all right. I think you did great. And I think you kind of made <laughs> this character, like you said, kind of a mix, but yet her own, which is really phenomenal. Even though God bless them, she was she was snarky. <laughs> but anyway, um, how much more do you feel of your characters developed in season two, and can we see even a little bit more development for the last few episodes? Yeah, we get to see her be vulnerable at times, and and that's a nice balance because. You know her energy is, is is up here, and we get to see her be <laughs> here. And, and for me, it's a it's a, a fine line because I don't want to drop my energy so low that it's boring and bland. It's, it still needs to be interesting, but I don't want to be up here when I'm like, you know what? I have some secrets to tell you. <laughs> so, <laughs> and we've had some amazing directors come through that are able to give me perspective on what's happening um, to keep the the energy moving forward because we are we do have a story to tell. And we are driving a lot. So like, how can I be vulnerable, but still keep it energized? And that's been lovely to learn. And how can you keep it vulnerable, yet in a way still funny? Mm -hmm. Well, you have to be raised. Yeah. You know, and just because I'm telling you this, I'm not just telling you this to tell you. Why am I telling you now? Why am I choosing to tell you either you or with someone else like what was that, that that dynamic that made you feel comfortable enough to say this and then what is that what are you trying to accomplish by telling them this so that's what helps to keep it energized yeah so if there's gonna be a season three what where would you like to see her head oh well you know we're we're, we're finally gonna get to see the duke and get to know him and right. so we'll time to spend with him but also just to continue to grow with her co-workers because we're always going to be at night for it um yeah. so what is that going to be like and what what cases are going to come through we've had some very weird and zany ones and so it's <laughs> going to keep climbing that ladder with all of them I mean there's plenty for them to go through because gosh I mean Manhattan night Court is still going on to this day so yeah. I'm <laughs> a lot of research to do and pull from um but yeah I want to see I want to meet her family I think that would be cool and to also meet Olivia like who is Olivia's mom she's been very yeah. old so who or will we get to meet her so we're putting out into the universe that there's gonna be <laughs> season three and 17 and 18 <laughs> to know these people and see their family and how crazy they are to have produced <laughs> well, I hope so, especially for like you, like Olivia and, and your character, because I think they do have more to give us. So thank you so much for your time today. I love the original. I love this one. It's just such a it, it, it's a nod to the original and what a great cast they were. So fantastic. Thank you for your time today. <laughs> thank you for having me. Hit like, smash subscribe and get notified for when our reviews, interviews, and news go live.